First, we're going to create a new repository in GitHub. And we're going to use this format for the repository name, username.github.io. The username of my account is Pragmatic Reviews, so I'm going to use that name. So this is Pragmatic Reviews. Dot github dot io. So this will be the URL to access our website on GitHub pages. And I'm going to click on create repository. Now I'm going to grab the URL from here and I'm going to clone the repo in my local environment. Okay, now let's clone the repo locally. Git clone and I'm going to paste the repo URL. Okay, now let's see into that folder. Now let's install the Angular CLI. So this is npm install minus g at angular slash cli and now let's create a new project within this repo ng new website and she is the angular command line interface and here i am creating a new project named website and we're going to set the directory of the project and this will be the local directory we are going to add angular routing and we're going to use css this is going to create the initial structure of the project the initial structure of the project has been successfully generated and the dependencies has been installed here within the node modules folder as usual so now let's open visual studio code Okay, and here we are going to make a change here within the Angular Chainsaw file. And we need to go here to Options, Output Path. And we're going to change this. Here we're going to put Docs. So when we build the Angular project, all the static assets and all the contents of our web application will be stored within that folder. And that will be the source for our GitHub Pages website. I'm going to close this. And I'm going to build the website so this is npm run build okay the website has been successfully built so if we take a look at the docs folder we're going to find all the static assets of our application so now let's commit all the changes so git add everything git commit minus m initial commit and now let's push everything to our repo Git push. Okay, now let's go to GitHub and let's take a look at our GitHub pages website. Okay, I'm going to reload this page to see the contents of our website. Here we can see our docs folder. So now let's go to settings and here we need to go to pages. And here we need to change the folder. We need to select docs as the source of our website. I'm going to click on save. And now I'm going to access our GitHub Pages website by clicking here on this URL, pragmaticreviews.github.io. And as we can see here, we have our Angular website deployed on GitHub Pages. That's all I have for today. Thank you guys for watching, and I see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.